Let's see how to calculate difference between two dates by using datadiff function in Excel VBA programming. We can use datadiff function in VBA to calculate total days between two dates, total months, years, weeks and quarters. On this sheet, I have two dates. One is task start date and second is task complete date calculate difference between these two dates in terms of total days, total weeks, total months, total quarters and total years. Let me add a command button quickly and write the VBA code. I'll go to developer tab, click on insert. From ActiveX control, I'm selecting command button. Let me drag a command button here. Then double click on this command button so that we can write VBA code on the click event of this command button. Now, what is the VBA code? So first, I'll create two variables of date type dim star date as date dim and underscore date as date we can give any name to these variables and then one more variable dim difference for that I'll say diff difference as integer now let me show you on Excel sheet, we have first date in cell A2 and task complete date is in cell B2. So here, start date equal to cells. For A2, we can say row number is 2, column is 1, dot value. Then end date equal to cells for b2 row number is 2 column is 2 dot value so we are assigning cell value or date to variables now we will calculate difference first in terms of days so let me show you total days I'll calculate here in cell B5. So what is the code for that? Variable that is named as difference. So I have written DIFF equal to function that we are going to use dated if bracket starts dated if function takes three parameters first what we want to calculate here we want to calculate only days so I'll write day in inverted commas then start date and then end date so these are actually variable and these variables have dates so how this dated if function can be declared keyword dated if then what we want to calculate start date and date and then cells row number 5 column 2 dot value equal to variable where we have calculated date difference in terms of days now let's check how this is working. Let me minimize this VB editor. Click on design mode so that we are out of design mode. Once I click on this command button, we can see that total days between complete date and start date are 397. So let me write here. This code is to calculate 
total days. Now let's see what else we want to calculate. We want to calculate total weeks, months, total quarters and total years in these cells. And we will use same dated if formula in VBA. So what we can do? We can copy this or just these two lines. Paste them here. Let me write to calculate total weeks. Now row number is 6 and for calculating weeks here we can change it to W. Now let me write the code for calculating months as well. So I will copy this this is to calculate total months for calculating months we can write here M row number is 7 then I will calculate quarters as well. So let me write quarters for that we can say instead of W we can write Q row number is 8 and then last that is calculating years. For calculating years between two dates, in dated if we will write 4 times y, row number is 9, we are done with the code. Now let me minimize this VB editor and click on this command button again. We can say that data day formula has worked perfectly and we can see here total days, total weeks, total months, total quarters and total years by using data day in VBA. Now let me show you the VBA code again. You can practice this code for calculating different kind of differences between two dates. I hope this is helpful for learning how to use dated if in VBA. Practice it and if you have any question around this topic write into comments and subscribe to my channel for more VBA tutorials. Thank you.